So the very first thing I start with is two slices of this bread. It's really big slices, so it makes uh, means you've got more area to spread Nutella on. And that looks a little bit like this. Um, and I have a glass of orange juice, 200 milliliters. It just tastes nice. It's refreshing when you just wake up. And a cup of coffee, of course. Um, to make sure I actually do wake up. Um, and I don't count any calories of coffee or the milk that goes in the coffee. As soon as we're on a bulk, there's not much point. Um, you know that once you've hit your calorie target, anything extra is just a bonus, really. So I don't, I don't count coffee. I don't count oil. Um, I don't count teas. Um, I don't count butter and sandwiches and stuff like that. Uh, all things that are quite difficult to measure. So it's 200 grams of granola. It's breakfast part two electric boogaloo with about 200 milliliters of semi skim milk. And then we'll just get this down and then on to the next meal. Just having a little lie on the sofa now in, you know, half a half a semi food coma <laughs> um, so the reason I have sort of breakfast split up into two is because I'm not good at eating a huge amount all at once especially first thing in the morning so it's easier for me just to wait an hour between the toast and the cereal I and mean, sometimes I have the cereal first sometimes I have the toast first um, and then just get it down that way and the reason the toast looks funny is because I fold it in half just because it's easier to eat them quicker. <laughs> this isn't really eating for pleasure, this is sort of eating for a purpose. Yeah, this is eating for a purpose, so it's just a case of calories in, calories out. <laughs> it's not for enjoyment, but you can enjoy it as much as you can. However, there comes a point where you stop enjoying it, you've eaten too much, you're force feeding yourself, so that's where I am. Four and a half thousand calories is a lot, but there you go. Um, so, yeah. Please leave a like and subscribe if you're enjoying it so far. And I'll see you in the next meal. Number three, the time is five past two. Got a steak pasta with homemade sauce. It's just a load of blended up vegetables. Um, so not really any calories in that. So I don't bother counting the calories of any vegetables or anything like that. Because it's all negligible. So it's just steak, really a rump steak and pasta. And then I've got a diet drink there. Really cheap, nasty drink, but it's really tasty. So it's hot day. Have it. Number four, we've got I don't know how many berries, frozen berries, um, just for the flavour and to cool it, cool it down. It's a lot nicer when it's cold. When it's warm, it's absolutely disgusting. Um, then in there, we've got 50 grams of peanut butter, the whole earth one, the natural one, no added sugar or anything like that. Then we've got um, a scoop of whey isolate and four, 20 grams of Nutella, which I think off the top of my head, and also 60 grams of oats. Let's blend it out. Now I won't lie to you and say this is delicious and it's tasty, it's horrible, but it's just liquid calories, it's nice and easy. Um, nothing artificial in there apart from the Nutella. Um, and yeah, quick. Um, and I hear lots of people say that you don't need to drink shakes and you shouldn't drink shakes and other people living and dying by their shakes um, and you know people might be confused I'll clear it up very quickly you don't need shakes but shakes are helpful if you are short on time if you're like me and you're trying to eat a lot of food and a lot of calories a lot of protein and you can't eat it all um, shakes are useful but you don't need shakes if I don't have a shake it won't kill me I won't lose any size um, you know 20 grams of chicken from 20 grams of protein sorry from chicken versus a shake absolutely no difference in the body it's just convenience so get this down and i'll see you at the next meal so i've done a leg workout i just went for like an eight mile bike ride um constant cycling no like freewheeling or anything just to get you know decent pump in the legs it was just too hot to squat today when you have to do your workout outside you really need like a fan or some air conditioning um because it just gets too hot but what can you do eh? um mum's pasta is what you saw in the video I'm guess in the picture, sorry, I'm guessing it's about 700 calories. Um, I'll work it out um, exactly, because I'm not sure off the top of my head, but I can't be bothered to now. <laughs> it gets to the point in the day, especially when it's hot and you've eaten so much, 
um, you really just feel tired. But we must keep eating. So the final thing I'll eat today is my secret weapon, Fox's Jam and Creams. This packet is 10 biscuits, 77 calories each. So the whole packet, 770 calories. Um, I'll just eat them. <laughs> it's simple as that. Um, and I was doing, I started off since I finished my job and I could eat, you know, whenever I liked. I started off doing 3.8 thousand calories, did that for two, a week and a half, and then I went up to 4 thousand, I did that for two weeks, maybe three, um, and then for the past sort of week, I've been maybe a bit less, I've been doing four and a half thousand, which is what you're um, seeing me eat now. And since I, since, for about two weeks, so since, you know, a week into the 2, 000, the 4 thousand calories, sorry, um, I've gained half a stone so I'm currently weigh weighing in at 81 kilos that's first thing in the morning so that's before I have any food any water anything at all I literally get out of bed weigh myself um 81 kilos which is great uh and I'll put all the what that is in pounds and stone and stuff because I know everyone in America does use pounds um so yeah I'm gaining weight very quickly which is unusual for me but I'll just keep riding out the dirty bulk hence the biscuits <laughs> and when the gym's open back up again there will be no trouble for me at all to lose the weight, um, lose the fat, sorry. Hopefully keep as much muscle as possible. So that's my full day of eating. Um, as you can see, I'm a broken man, um, but I hope you enjoyed. It's, it's more or less the same every day. You know, there's a bit of variety. Um, but if you want to see another one, perhaps, um, do let me know. And I can't think of anything else to say. I need to go eat these and go to sleep, I think. Cool, I'll, uh, I'll catch you in the next one.